Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we will discuss about manipulating of the protein structure. Sometimes we download structure from the protein data bank and it may not only include our protein of interest, it may contain some other proteins. So how to find out that how many chains are there in PDB structures and what are these chains? We will do this in PyMol and we will also do that how to color each chain or how to color specific segment of each chain. So let's do it. This is PyMol and now let's get the PDB structure from the PDB data bank. The code of the protein is 4GRL and then click search. This is the crystal structure of autoimmune TCR MHC complex. Click on this. In this page, this is the full information about this protein. Click on download files and download this structure in PDB format. So click on PDB format. It will be downloaded soon. The structure is downloaded now and I will open it in PyMol. Go to file menu and click on open. Browse for the structure. This is the structure I want to manipulate this structure. So I have opened the structure and now I will find out that how many chains are there. So how to find this? We can find in different way. First by showing the sequence. So go and show the sequence from here. Click on this S option. This is the sequence. From here you can find the chain. This is chain A. This is chain B. This is chain C. And this is chain D. So this protein has four chains A, B, C and D. The second way how to find the chains by coloring the chains. So go next to this all and click on C and color by chain. So one, two, three, four. Four chains are there. So these are the two methods how to find out the chains. Now we will find that what are these chains. There are four chains but what are these chains. We can find out this in two different ways. One from here. We can find it from here. This is the title of this structure and mole ID 1. So the, this is the chain A. So it is, this is MHC class 2, HLA, alpha chain. And then this is chain A, it's engineer. So these four lines for is for the first chain. Now mole ID 2. And these four lines will be for the second chain and this is MHC class 2 antigen. And the third mold ID, these four lines is for the chain C and this is the TCR. And these four lines are for chain D and this is the TCR. So we will delete these two TCR chains and we will only leave this MHC molecule. So how, so one way we can find from here and the other way we can find from this PDB data bank. This is the page which contains the whole information about this protein. So go down from here, macromolecules. So this is the entity ID1. This is the MHC class 2 molecule and this is chain A and this is the sequence length and this is the organism. Now go down. This is uh, entity ID2 and this chain B is also MHC class 2 antigen and the sequence length is 200. Now go down. This is the entity ID3 and this is the TCR molecule and this is chain C and this is the sequence length. Go down. This is the entity ID4 and this is the TCR and it's chain D. Now go down. This is the molecule and sometimes it's come from the crystallization. So we don't need this. 
so this protein has four chains a b c and d so we will delete the tcr and we will only keep the mhc molecule let's go back to pymol how to delete there are different ways i will teach you one by one one method is by selecting the chain and the second method is by deleting the chain so how we will select the chain so before this i will a little explain this corner if you want to if if i want to select this chain so i will click it here by clicking left mouse button but it only select the residue and i want to select the whole chain i can select it in this way like this and then select this then select this but this is not the professional way so there is a very good option in pymol by selecting the chain so come here this is selecting residue we can change this option by clicking the right mouse button here and change it to chain there are many options available like segments objects molecules carbon alpha atoms residues and chain now if i click on this first residue it will select the whole chain and then select any over here it will deselect it and if i want to select this residue it will also select the whole chain so i want to keep chain a and i want to keep chain b so i will select chain a and then go and select chain b now i will save these two chains so go to file menu and export molecule and here here you will change it to selly it means selection it will save those chain that are selected by me or you can these are my selection so you can change or rename it from here rename selection and here i will give it specific name like chain a b and then press enter now go to file menu and click on export molecule and here you will change it to chain a b and click save and browse where you want to save this and i want to save this in pdb format chain a b click save now i have saved this molecule now i want to check whether i really save these two two chains or not so i will reinitialize this one by clicking this and click on everything so i remove everything now i got fresh window of the file mode now go to file menu click on open and click on this chain a b now click uh, on color now let's find out how many chains are there so go next to all and click on c option and color by chain so there are two chains here now let's go toward the second method by deleting the chain so again i will i will reinitialize everything and open the structure again and go next to all to color it by chain and show the sequence from here these are the sequences i want to keep chain a and b and i want to delete chain c and d so change this to, to chains chain click here and then right click your mouse button and then click remove i have deleted chain c you can select it from here or you can also select from here 
click everywhere on this yellow chain so it will be selected and then click right mouse button and remove from here or you can remove it from here both methods are okay now i have deleted the other two chains and i only leave chain a and b and there are water molecules these red color are water molecule so if you want to remove water molecule too then go next to all and click on action and remove water so i have removed the water and then save this protein by going to pile menu click uh, export molecule and there are only two chains in this pymol window so i we don't need to change this it will be like this and click on save and change this to pdb and i will replace this with chain ab replace now i will check whether i have successfully saved these two chains or not so reinitialize everything then again click open and open this structure yeah and then go next to all and click on c by chain so this these are the different way you can manipulate your structure and go to the sequence and find out whether there is any other thing or so this is in ag there is one molecule in ag so we will delete this so click on this and then with right mouse button remove it and then you can save this and if you want to change the color give different color to each chain then select the chain a and click right mouse click right mouse button and come down to color and color green red blue whatever you like and click on blue so it changed to blue and now i want to change the color of this chain so select this chain and then right mouse button and color yellow okay and if you want to change the color of a specific segment of this protein so how you will do that then change this to residue for example if i want to change the color of this beta sheet but i don't know where its position in this sequence so what will you do click here zoom it a little like this and then move it to the center and then click here so we and yeah or and then select here so this is yeah so this region is between isoleucine and arginine so select all those residues one by one and then right mouse button and then color color like orange so you can change it like this if you want to color specific region of a chain you can do it like this so it's enough for today and let's meet in the next lecture and take care bye bye